welcome to a new Gimbal Guru video. In this one, I show you 5 unique Gimbal movements and transitions, which you can create easily with your Gimbal. The first one is the FPV Gimbal movement. This Gimbal movement looks like you're flying FPV drone. The dynamic camera shot creates a very unique perspective for the viewer. You can easily create this effect by setting your Gimbal on the POV mode. The POV mode unlocks every Gimbal axis and the camera is following your movement. You achieve the best results if you move fast forward and at the same time you move left and right with the roll axis. If you want to combine the FPV gimbal movement into a transition, I recommend you to tilt up the camera in the first and tilt down the camera in the second shot. By blending the two sequences together you get a nice FPV gimbal transition. The second transition is the locked on spin gimbal transition. For this shot again use the POV mode on the gimbal. You follow the movement of an object. In this example I followed the roll movement of the person's hand in the frame. This gimbal movement creates again a very unique motion for the viewer. It's very simple to achieve a transition when you film two sequences in different locations. By flipping the second shot horizontally, you get a nice continuous roll transition. If you add motion blur in post-production, you achieve a smooth locked-on spin gimbal transition. The third gimbal transition idea is the run by location change gimbal transition. This one is very simple. Activate the lock mode on your gimbal. The lock mode, as the name suggests, locks every gimbal axis. Now you can run, even in rough terrain, and the gimbal stabilizes your video footage. To create the run by location changing transition, the person in the video has to pass an object. The gimbal and camera operator also passes the object in near distance. You do the same in a different location and mask the two shots together. This passing by transition is very common, but also very impressive at the same time. The next gimbal transition is the follow object transition. For this one I suggest you to use the go or sport mode on your gimbal. This mode enables very fast movements which is perfect for the follow object movement. The idea behind this transition is very simple. You follow the movement of an object in your frame, do the same in a different location and blend the two shots together. The last gimbal movement is more kind of a demonstration of the creative possibilities which a gimbal offers you. You easily can create hyperlapses by setting your gimbal mode to locked. Now the gimbal locks the camera direction and you can walk forward without having to fear that the alignment of your camera is changing. If you speed up the video in post-production, you get a nice hyperlapse video. Those were my 5 unique gimbal transitions and movements, which you can easily try out yourself. In this video I used the Crane 2S. The Xion Crane 2S is the perfect DSLR camera gimbal. It has all the important gimbal modes plus a lot more and it's perfect for every creative filmmaker. Check out the links in the description for a Gimbal Guru special offer. Keep in mind that the presented gimbal transitions and movements are not limited only for DSLR gimbals. You can also achieve these effects with your GoPro or action camera gimbal. For example, the Hoem iSteady Pro 3 is the perfect action cam gimbal, which provides all necessary modes. I have also linked you my software, with which I do the post-production. I hope you learned something new and enjoyed the video. Subscribe to my channel and stay up to date with gimbals, video editing, action cameras, 360 videos and much more. I see you in the next video. Ciao!